with nearly 620,000 overseas students coming to Australia, and they all need a place to stay. Imagine you're one of those students. You go to university site, and you're looking for accommodation, somewhere to live. And you're faced with a multitude of links, with confusing information, covering almost every type of accommodation package. And imagine you find the one. And you apply, and you wait for days, maybe weeks, while your application is processed. And if you're too late, you have to start out all over again. What you need is a what if for student accommodation. Somewhere where you can search and compare offerings, where you can read reviews, where you can select, and where you can book online. And what you need is StudyPad. StudyPad aggregates the accommodation provider's information. What you do is go on and put in your preferred location, the amount of money you'd like to pay, and other must-have features. And you leave the rest to StudyPad, and then you just book online. StudyPad study is here to aggregate the accommodation provider's offerings, and we're here for overseas, interstate, and country students who are coming here to study and looking for accommodation. How do we make money? From accommodation providers. They pay a placement fee to study pad for those accommodation bookings. There are 76,000 dedicated student accommodation beds in Australia, giving a total rental value of $912 million, with a total addressable market for those placement fees of $41 million. By the third year, StudyPad aims to um, access those placement fees and achieve $4.1 million by representing 70% of those accommodation providers. What's in it for the students? Well, they have choice. They go to one site, they search all the options, and they book online. What's in it for the accommodation providers? Well, StudyPad helps them achieve 100% occupancy and increase their profits. And what's in it for the universities? They provide a better accommodation service and they have more satisfied students. It's a great idea. Everyone that we've spoken to has said so. But if you really wanted to make this happen, what would you need? You need a team, a team with senior leadership experience within the international education sector. They would have to have sta established relationships with the key stakeholders. They would need to understand both the needs of the students, the education institutions, and the student accommodation providers and they would need to understand the dynamics and the drivers of demand in the industry. They would also need time and resources, preferably their own resources, to invest in the project. My name is Andre Amrine, and I'm the founder and managing director of StudyPad. I'm also the, man the general manager of TAFE SA International. I believe in the StudyPad concept so strongly that I'm taking six months off my current role and pursuing the StudyPad concept full time. Together with Tony Dyson, an educationalist, business developer, and serial entrepreneur, we are StudyPad. <laughs> and in the first year, we aim to represent several uh, national accommodation providers in South Australia. And by the second and third year, we aim to be national and representing those because we've established credibility and proven increase in bookings. And we also plan to expand internationally by having royalty-based license agreements to operate in the UK, USA, and Canada. StudyPad is an established limited company, and we plan to be launched and available 
by the end of this year, ready for the 2012 student intake. And we're looking for an investor to put in $250,000, and we aim to give a return of $1 million by the end of the third year. It's a great concept. It addresses a market niche, a proven market niche, and we're able to, uh, with the proven market niche, we're looking to um, address this and we're addressing this market niche uh, through a proven and successful business model that's used by the likes of Webjet and whatif.com. What and we bring to the mix motivation um, and also industry contacts. I give you StudyPad. 